Let's fast forward this a little bit to 20 years from now, where Tredavious White perhaps starts going through massive bouts of depression. Had only a couple of years career in the NFL. Went through a dark time. Ends up going through such a dark time, takes his own life. And we realize he was going through fits of rage, violent tendencies, self-doubt, depression, acted out. And we go back 20 years, we go, remember in 2017 when Rob Gronkowski, now in the Hall of Fame, threw 265 pounds into the back of that guy's skull, face down on the ground? That couldn't have helped. What Gronk did was the dirtiest thing in the NFL this season, and he got one game. And let me just spin it this way. Let's say that hit happened to a quarterback. Let's say that hit happened from a defensive player onto a quarterback. So let me give you the possibility on the opposite side of this. Let's take Shaq Lawson of the Buffalo Bills. And let's say he's been speed rushing, edge rushing Tom Brady in that same exact game all day long. Shaq Lawson comes around the edge and he's held. Shaq Lawson tries to swim move and he's face masked. Shaq Lawson tries to go low or a bull rush, held, dragged down, pulled down. Let's say on a play inside the red zone, Shaq Lawson comes around the edge is held face masked and dragged down, but somehow gets one hand onto Tom Brady's foot to make Brady fall, but Brady can get the ball out and hits Rob Gronkowski in the end zone for a touchdown. And Shaq Lawson gets up and is so furious that he has been held, that he's been dragged down and face masked all game. He looks at Brady on the ground, sees the touchdown scored by Gronk, and he takes his 265 pounds, and slams his shoulder into Brady's helmet, smashing Brady's head off of the field turf. Brady leaves the game with a concussion. What do you think Shaq Lawson gets? Think he gets one game? But what, the life of Tom Brady is more important than Tredavious White because he's Tom Brady. It's the dirtiest play in the NFL this season, and Gronk gets one game. It's a double standard. It's a total double standard. It is the scummiest, most disgusting play of the football season. And again, because Gronk is the lovable lug nut, the guy that gives you a noogie, the funny guy that chugs a beer, burps, and then dances. Well, you know, no priors. Well, you know, he's a good guy. There would be a national incident if a defensive player did that to Tom Brady or Aaron Rodgers or Drew Brees or Matt Ryan. If that player took his shoulder and pile drove it into the back of a quarterback's helmet on the ground as he laid prone. The guy would be done for the rest of the regular season and maybe the postseason as well. That's a four-game suspension if that happens to a quarterback, no? But for Tredavious White and Gronk, well, one game, and then Gronk's going to appeal. Nice look.